So first thing I'm doing is I am putting on a moisturizer just to moisturize my face because I don't want it to get really dry. And then next I am putting on some concealer on my eyes and under my eyes just to help conceal some of the veins. Then I put on my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish and I just put that all over my face and it kind of helped give a more full coverage except not doing it like overdone. <laughs> Then I took this pinky rose blush from CoverGirl and I put that on my cheeks just with an angled blush brush. You guys have probably seen me put on eye primer close to a hundred times so I just sped it up and went on to eyebrows. So I'm using this Wet n Wild eyebrow pencil and I've been kind of doing my eyebrows a little bit differently although not too on point because I don't know I didn't like the appeal of having caterpillars on my face. Then, oh my gosh, I use this eyeshadow palette that I haven't used in such a long time. It's this Estee Lauder palette, and I don't even know the names of it, so I'll put them on the screen, but I just use this light shimmer color, and then I use Max Wood Ringed in my crease because I have been loving that eyeshadow recently. Then I just use the Stila Waterproof Eyeliner in Brown on my upper lash line just because it kind of gave a more gel appeal to it because I didn't want a super harsh line and I just liked how this one looked a little bit softer and blended out. And then for lips, I just use the Baby Lips and Grapevine kind of going a little bit more simple for Monday. I use the Rimmel Fit Me Primer and I've been breaking out a little bit more on my forehead and around my nose but instead of concealing them up and clogging up it I just decided to go with a powder just real simple natural so I just use the NYC Smooth Skin Powder and then the Posy Tint Blush from Benefit. Then I just mixed a gray and brown eyeshadow together and filled in my eyebrows. Then doing my eyes again with the eye primer from e.l.f. Then I am taking this Urban Decay eyeshadow and I've been really into soft champagne eyeshadow so I'm just using that with a little fluffy crease brush and then I am taking Liar from the Naked 3 palette and putting that into my crease. I decided to skip eyeliner because I was running late for school so I just went for mascara and this is just the e.l.f. lengthening and volumizing mascara and I put that on my upper and lower lashes. Then I just took this rose lipstick from American Beauty and I patted that onto my lips because I didn't want it to be too strong. And that, that is what I wore for Tuesday's makeup. <laughs> Then I took the Maybelline BB Cream and I put that under my eyes, on my nose, and then some of my acne that was on my forehead just to kind of tone it down some. Then I just used the NYC Smooth Skin Powder all over my face to set the makeup. Then I took the bronzer from the e.l.f. Bronzer and Blush Duo and I just contoured my cheekbones. Then I took this Wet n Wild Eyebrow Pencil in Taupe slash Brown I believe it in and then I just filled in my eyebrows. Next, I just primed my eyes using the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer and then I went in with this e.l.f. Cream Eyeshadow and I believe Moon Light and I just put that on my eyes as kind of like a base and then I took this Rimmel Eyeshadow Quad and I took the two darkest colors and I put that on my lids. Then I took the e.l.f. Eyeliner and I did a simple line on my upper lash line and then I took the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and put that on my upper and bottom lashes. Then I took a Color Whisper from Maybelline in Faint Fuchsia and I put that on my lips. And there's Wednesday's makeup. First thing I'm doing is I'm taking this NYC powder and I'm just putting that all over my face. I kind of wanted a more natural look so I didn't go with all the concealer. Then I took this Wet n Wild eyebrow pencil and I contoured my nose. I wanted my nose just to look a little bit skinnier and I've been having a little bit fun messing around with contouring. Then I used the same eyebrow pencil and I filled in my eyebrows and then I took a white eyeliner and outlined my eyebrows and blended that out just to highlight my eyebrows and make the shape cleaner. Then for eyeshadow, I used Woodwinked from MAC and I put that into my crease and then I took Liar from the Naked 3 palette and used a smaller brush and I put that into my outer V. Then I used some brown liquid eyeliner and I put that on my upper lash line and then of course I did some mascara and I used the e.l.f. lengthening and volumizing mascara. Then for lipstick, I used a DIY berry lip balm that I made. And there's Thursday's makeup completed. Then starting off Friday's makeup, I used the Dream Matte Wonder Concealer from Maybelline under my eyes. 
Then I set it using the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Neutral and I just put that all over my face. For blush, I used the BH Cosmetics Blush Duo in Tulip and I just put that on my cheeks. Then I used a NYX Cream Eyeshadow and I just put that on my eyelids and blended it out. Then I used Jess from MAC and I used that to set the NYX eyeshadow. Then I just used Woodwinked in the outer corner and in my crease. Then I used an NYC mascara on my upper and lower lashes. Then I used a Pop Beauty lip stain and then over that I used this NYX Jimbo eye pencil and I put that on my lips just to add a pop of color. And that is Friday's makeup and that is the end of this makeup of the week video. It's a normal!